Hello friends, welcome to Oracle tutorial. In today's session, we are going to see how to download and install the PLSQL developer from the internet. So before we start the installation, I will show you how to download the setup from the internet. To download the setup, navigate to the Google and type all of the information PLSQL developer. And you will give the first link. Open the first link and uh, it will redirect to the official site of PLSQL developer. And here you can see uh, the overview of PLSQL developer and all the latest features of PLSQL developer. To download the setup, uh, click on free trial and it will take you to the download page. In this page, you need to select uh, the setup. You need to select the setup based on your machine compatibility. If your machine is uh, 32 bit and you need to select 32 bit. If your machine is uh, 64 bit and uh, you need to select the 64 bit and click download. So in my case, I have already downloaded the, downloaded the setup and I'm going to show you how to install now. So to do install, right click on the setup and click open. So it will uh, take you to the installation wizard. So in this first step, you need to click on next. And in this next step, you need to select the accept the terms and condition. And in the third step, you need to select whether you want to install this PLS developer for all the users which are associated with this machine or you want to restrict for the current user. So my case, I'm selecting install for all users. So click next. And uh, in this step, I'm going, to install, I'm going to show you how to install the trial version. So PLS developer purely a license version. So if you install the trial version, you will be able to use the PLS developer up to 30 days. After 30 days, you cannot use unless you purchase the valid license from the PLS developer official site. So click trial version and click next. I'm going to install the complete version of PLS developer. So I have selected the complete. Click next and click install. It will take uh, 10, to 30, 10 to 20 seconds to install based on your mission capability. So that's it. Uh, PLS Cool Developer uh, installation has been completed. So now we will see how to connect the schema with the PLS Cool Developer. Open the PLS Cool Developer. And uh, this will ask you the schema name and password. So in my case, in my local machine, I have already database installed. So I'm going to connect the sys user. So I, I've given uh, sys as my username and I'm giving the password for the same. And my database uh, SID is XE, and I'm connecting sys, so I have to connect as sysdba. So click OK. That's it. We were able to connect the PLSQL developer with the schema. So to write SQL statement, here in the drop down, you can select the SQL window. So I will show you one sample SQL statement. So Run the query, either you can uh, click the run button or you can press the F8 key. So that's it. We have been successfully installed the PLSQL developer. So if you have installed a uh, trial version, you will be able to use up to 30 days. So after 30 days, you cannot use the PLSQL developer unless uh, you have the valid license. License you can purchase from the all around automation site. You can refer uh, the license information in the official site. So in my case, I have uh, uh, database installed in my local machine. So if you are connecting uh, uh, the server, then in that case, you must have Oracle uh, client in your machine. So unless or until uh, uh, you have the client in your machine, you cannot connect the database. So that's it, a very simple installation. So if you have any queries on the installation, you can uh, leave a comment in the comment section. So if you like my videos, you can subscribe my, my channel for the regular update. Thanks. Thank you for watching.